Hi, my name is Megan Gidley and I'm the Director of Marketing with Connect. Welcome back to the Get Connected podcast. Today, I'm going to be giving you the recap and the highest seller from the Nielsville Machinery and Horse Sale. This was a huge three-day sale, so if you missed our live stream of this sale, you can check it out now on our YouTube channel. Let's dive in. Let me start by just saying, if you've never seen our live streams of this sale or been to the Nielsville Machinery and Horse Sale, you are truly missing out. Take a look. This doesn't even do justice to just how much stuff they have to offer. Everything from horses, driving horses, to ponies, to riding horses, all of the machinery you can imagine, and a bunch of antiques. Really, anything that you can imagine ever needing or wanting, Nielsville has this to offer. With just how massive this sale is, we're gonna do something a little bit different for this podcast. I'm not just gonna be giving you the highest overall seller from the sale. I'm gonna be giving you the highest seller from each portion of the sale, including the draft, driving, and pony sales. We're gonna start out with the highest seller from the draft horse portion of the Nielsville Machinery and Horse Sale. The highest seller for the draft sale was lot number 14, which sold for a whopping $13,750. Lot number 14 was part of a blonde team that were three quarters brothers and very well matched. They are one-year-old Belgians and they were consigned by Eli Yoder. Congrats to the highest seller from the draft portion of the Nielsville Machinery and Horse Sale. Now, the highest seller from the driving portion of this sale was lot 510, which sold for a whopping $9,750. Now, as always, I'm only giving you a portion of the information on the highest sellers. If you want to find out more information on each specific lot, you can find the catalogs for the Nielsville Machinery and Horse Sale on our website, which is www.connect.com under auction information, and then just look for the Nielsville Machinery and Horse Sale. Now, the highest seller for the pony portion of the Nielsville Machinery and Horse Sale was a tie between lots 378 and 482. Both of these lots sold for $5,000 a piece. Again, a huge congrats to all of the highest sellers and their consigners, and congrats to all of the buyers of the highest sellers. You guys really did get just amazing lots. If you wanna see any of these highest sellers in action, you can check them out on our live stream from the sale, which can be found on our YouTube channel, and the link to that is also posted on our Facebook page. Again, I really can't stress enough just how simply fantastic this sale is. If you have never attended in person, the sale is in Nielsville, Wisconsin, or watched our live stream on our YouTube channel, you really are missing out. You've got to check it out. I hope you all have enjoyed this special podcast and very unique podcast. We will definitely be back at Nielsville next year and also in the fall, so make sure you stay tuned for more. Thanks for watching and have a great week.